Sam Moulton, editor of Outside Magazine's Buyer's Guides, here with you to talk about sunglasses. Uh, finding the right pair of sunglasses can be tricky. Maybe you got a funny shaped head, maybe you're really picky, or maybe you're like my friend Brooke, who's a guy and has really long eyelashes and so needs to get sunglasses that have really have a lot of eye clearance uh, in the eye socket. Uh, for a good pair of sunglasses, expect to pay about 100 bucks, and the two uh, features to look for in the lenses are whether or not they're photochromatic and polarized. Uh, photochromatic lenses adjust the lens tint uh, according to the amount of available light and polarized lenses, as you probably know, help cut glare when driving or uh, around water. And uh, if your current sunglasses uh, have neither of those features, it might be time for an upgrade. And uh, let's take a look at a few of our top uh, sunglasses from last year. If we uh, gave an award to the most versatile pair of sunglasses, it'd have to be the Bole Traverse. And while it might look like a regular pair of sunglasses, uh, it comes with a slew of accessories that allow you to uh, adapt it to basically any sport. It also has a snap-on brow piece which is made of foam. You just snap it in, like so. And then you've got additional protection from sun or sweat. Our testers wore this uh, when they were cycling especially. So you can also turn this sunglass into a snow goggle. You can remove the eyepiece, you snap in this foam gasket, like so. You remove the temples, snap on the headband. You've got a pair of goggles. Retails for about $160 and it's the Bolet Traverse.